Good morning. Oh, my eyebrows look super intense. I don't know what to do about them. Because if I don't put anything on them, I look scary. If I do put anything on them, I look scary. So, any ideas, please let me know about the eyebrow situation. It's Monday morning, 6.15, and I'm on the way. I have six more days at this school, and I'm so excited. Um, I feel like I always find a way to complain in the morning, so here's, here's what's going on this morning. Um, yesterday, I hiked nine miles. I don't know why I thought that was a good idea, but it was a wet hike, and so my tennis shoes gave me blisters. So... <laughs> I'm wearing some new shoes that I got from Walmart that were only like $9 and they're so comfortable. They're like memory foam. When I'm not driving in the dark, I will show you. But they're so comfortable and I definitely recommend them if you are standing for long periods of time somewhere. But they're just uncomfortable now. I was so excited about them. But now they're uncomfortable because I have blisters on my feet. So. That'll teach me not to walk around ever in tennis shoes, wet tennis shoes. But anyways, I'm on the way. I've got some toast with avocado on it and a almost dead phone because it didn't charge last night. But I'm going to use it anyways to listen to podcasts this morning because if I don't, I will be super bored my whole drive there the entire hour of it. So, yeah. Today is a pretty straightforward day. Just student teaching in the SPED classroom with the three, four, five-year-olds. And then after that, I'm going home. So... That's what we're doing today. I'm here. It's getting light outside. That's cool. Um, I got my name tag on. It looks like it's too low. Uh, but after today, I only have one more Monday here. Uh, people are staring at me. Anyways, I'm about to walk in. See what I mean about my eyebrows? Too much. Pretty. These are the Walmart shoes I was telling you about. Really comfy if I didn't have blisters. I'll stop. That's what they look like. in the car and heading home. There are people staring at me, which is why you're in my lap. It was a crazy day. Actually, it was an okay day. My feet just hurt a lot. I'm getting Zaxby's. And my shoes are in the floor because they hurt. I'm not having a super great morning. I woke up 45 minutes late and my throat is killing me. I feel like poo and like I need to go back to bed for five hours. I don't know if it's the exposure to kids again or the pollen in the air or what, but I don't feel good. It's raining and my dog threw up in my room. So supposed to usually leave around 6.10 and it's almost 6.30. Whoa. Well, that's Tuesday. I'm here. And I'm so tired. <laughs> My throat hurts. 
it's gonna be a long day. I'm so tired. I'm about to head to math. I still feel pretty gross. But I just wanted to share this story. So this morning I was playing with this student with these little like toy animals and he can be slightly defiant <laughs> and keep in mind this is like a four-year-old so I like leaned over and I was reaching for something and he like snatched up the back of my shirt and like touched my back I don't know it was weird but I was like um no we're not doing that and then I just went about my day and then it wasn't until lunch that I was like something feels weird in my pants and then I just ignored it and I ate lunch and then I walked around for like an hour and a half and then I like felt it drop down in my pants and I felt behind my leg and underneath my pants I was like oh my god what is that is that a bug what is that so I went to the bathroom and this was in my pants a broken toy scorpion I'm finally done with class and I'm so hungry and so ready to go I just made it home it's 6 30 I don't feel good. I'm on my way. It's Wednesday. I don't feel good. If I didn't have an observation today, I probably wouldn't be going. But my supervisor was supposed to come the week before last and she didn't, so. Today is the only day she can come for our last observation, so I'm going. It took two day quilt. Hopefully that will help. But I don't feel good at all. I'm here. And I'm feeling like I got an attitude. Hello, it is no longer the week, it's Sunday now. Basically, my recording for the week stopped because I felt so bad, so gross, like cold chills, headache, sore throat, whole thing. So I didn't record the rest of the week, really sorry. But I figured I would just like continue this video on into next week and next week is my very last week at the school where I'm student teaching and it makes me kind of sad so today is Sunday so I finished writing a paper today I'm just kind of getting all my stuff together for next week um, I got these thank you cards from Walmart they're super cute that's my dog and I'm gonna write thank you notes to all of my mentor teachers that I had at this school and to the principal you know just to do some sucking up and then I also got these for the pre-Kers, blue and pink, so that they have a choice. Pre-Kers love choices. And right now I'm about to clean my room, like really clean it, like my closet, everything. I'm just gonna clean everything out. And I'm gonna do this face mask that I got at Walmart and that's pretty much it i'll try to do a much better job recording this week this week's probably going to be really sad because it's my last week um it's also our last week of classes so next week is like a debriefing week and then we have finals the week after that so i'll try to do my best to record a lot of things this week Okay, so I have this mask on. I feel like I'm drowning in it. <laughs> and I kind of feel like I look like I'm about to kill someone. 
it's like a double layer and it's like hooks around your ears it's got two i don't know it looked like a mummy hmm. anyways <laughs> if you're interested in oh, mm. if you're interested in shoes and good deals i just wanted to show you these shoes so i got these shoes from walmart for nine dollars they're really cute and I got these shoes from Target. I think they were like 15, around 15, I don't know, but they're super cute. Then I also got these from Walmart and they were also like $9 and they have memory foam. And they're really cute. They're like denim colored kind of. But if you're looking for some really comfy shoes, these are so comfy and I get blisters really easily. But these are like bendy right here. So I don't, don't get blisters from them. They're super comfy. So these are my new go-to's. If you like cheap shoes that are comfy, there you go. I organized one drawer and I'm already feeling like I want to be done with this. Just finished writing all the thank you cards. Make me really sad. Mm. This is the principal, and these are my three mentor teachers before the pre-K teacher, which I'm gonna give her her separate. So, aren't these cards so pretty? Let's do this. Finally, on the way. It's 6.20. Usually I leave at 6.10. Story of my life. But it's my last Monday. I'm so excited. Um, the reason I'm leaving late this morning is because I couldn't get my smoothie to open. I made an avocado smoothie for breakfast with my like Nutribullet thing. And the lid wouldn't come off. It took me like seven minutes to get it off. And finally, my dad did it. So that's why we're running late today. It's always something. But yeah. I'm still sitting in the car. <sighs> I don't understand why it's cold again. Ugh. I'm home now. I went to Target and I got some things. It was a good day, by the way. Ew. Um, I mean, it was a normal day. Only two days left. Woo woo. So I got mugs for the teachers that I'm with right now in the pre-case bedroom. I got this one that says, today's goal, keep the tiny humans alive. I thought that was so cute. I kinda want it for myself. Got some tampons. Um, I got this mug that says, don't make me use my teacher voice. Super cute. It came with some weird stuff. And then I got this one that says, let the adventure begin. And then for my supervisor from my school, I got her a gift card and the other two interns at the school are chipping in too. So I'm only paying $5 for it. Um, and then I got her a card for the gift card, and it says, you went out of your way, and it was out of this world. On the inside, it says, thanks for everything. And then for the teacher's mugs, I just got some white tissue paper and then three of these cute bags. Super cute. And that's all. So my original plan was to get these chaos coordinator stickers for the teacher's in the pre-case bedroom and put them on mugs because they're so cute. They came from Etsy 
and Etsy said they wouldn't be delivered in time. So I improvised and got these mugs. But what do you know? They're here in time. Whatever. And the sore throat is back. For some reason, I think I was thinking that because this is my last week, somehow magically getting up early would be easy because I would be excited. Not happening. It's Tuesday. It's 6.30. I'm supposed to leave at 6. I almost, like, tried to go in late because I'm so tired. Now my throat hurts again. I even went to bed early last night. I don't know. And it's cold outside. It's like 49 degrees and it's mid-April. Come on, Georgia, get it together. Anyways, because I'm having such a hard time getting up, I decided to treat myself to popcorn for breakfast. So that's what I'm about to do. Listen to a podcast. If you're wondering, it's Ear Biscuits because I love Good Mythical Morning. And I'm going to eat popcorn. And we're going to get there when we get there today. Thanks for joining me. I'm here and I'm walking in. And it's cold. <laughs> Wraps all the kids have painted. Super cute. driving home. I'm tired. I am having Subway for dinner. It's really pretty outside. It's 75 now. Much better than this morning. Um, today we did our Easter egg hunt outside, which was fun. A little bit chaotic. I did have to like hook finger a Hershey's Kiss out of a three-year-old's mouth because there was aluminum foil still. She just put the whole thing in her mouth with the aluminum foil still on. Um, but it was a good day, it was fun. Tomorrow's my last day. I gotta figure out how I'm gonna carry um, my teacher's gifts, the cookies, like how I'm gonna carry everything in tomorrow. I may need like a big giant bag, I don't know. But tonight, I'm gonna finish, write, finish writing thank you cards for the pre-K teachers. And that's pretty much it for tonight. Tomorrow I have to study for my math test I have on Thursday. So tonight I'm just gonna do that and then just chill. Cause I'm tired. But yeah. Oh, and I also stopped and got some gummy bears because um, that's what the kid requested that he wanted on Thursday for our last day together. It's Wednesday and it's my last day at my school and I'm so excited! Oh my gosh, I'm so ready to be done. But it wasn't easy to get up this morning. The excitement wasn't enough. Um, I'm also having popcorn again for breakfast because I'm celebrating and I don't care and I'm really hungry. Um, I put all the gifts and the cookies and stuff in this giant bag. Plus I have my teacher bag and my lunchbox and my water bottle so walking in this morning is going to be a fun adventure um but yeah i'm so excited literally i think all day long this is going to be running through my head my last time walking in my last time walking down this hallway my last time doing 
breakfast with them like all day long I'm gonna be thinking that and like checking things off my mental list because I'm a weirdo and that's just what I think about but anyways happy Wednesday I don't think I'll be this excited on a Wednesday for a long time I just pulled in and I'm already feeling kind of sad so weird I have this giant bag back here with the presents and stuff in it that I'm gonna try and attempt to carry along with this bag. Let's go. Did it, I'm done, woo! Oh, I'm so tired. I'm so glad to be done. Oh, it was a long day, a lot of goodbyes, a lot of screaming kids. They had a rough day today, but I'm done. No more wearing this. No more long drive. I'm a little bit sad, but I'm a lot happy. I'm leaving and heading to my Thursday class. And I have two board games, a card game, gummy bears, and two Dr. Seuss books because that's the kids' favorite. And um, last night everyone was like talking on the group message and we all decided that We'll do whatever we have to do today for like the first half. Then the last half, we're going to take them all outside and do activities with them. So that'll be fun. And it gives me less than I have to entertain him for. Because I seem to be really bad at that because he gets bored. So anyways, this is the last time I'm seeing him. We have that and then we have another class. And then I have a math test. That's Thursday. In here. Let's do this. Done with that, woo! And now I have like an hour or so break until my next class and I'm going to eat with a few of the girls. Barbecue. So, yeah, bye. I'm done with that class now. This is our last class until our final. Our last class of that class until our final. So now I'm going to my sister's house to drop off my food and my clothes and to change into something comfier and then I have a math test at four. The math test is over. I'm at my sister's house now. Waiting for her to get home. The math test was okay. There were a few things on it that I didn't really know. So now I'm sitting here with my binder I'm going to do a little bit of homework before she gets here. Because what else am I going to do? Now I've decided I'm going to drive back to school, which is only like five minutes from here, because I just found out that I got some sort of certificate from Honors Day. And I want to pick it up because that's kind of cool. And after next week, they throw them away. So I'm going to go pick it up really quick. This is pretty cool. This is the, um, what is it called? I don't know. Handout, pamphlet, program. This is the program for the um, Honors Day thing that they had. And then College of Education. Outstanding Elementary SPED major, Taylor Hunt. That's pretty cool. Woohoo! Good morning. Well, it's a little past, mm, mm, it's still morning. It's 11 o'clock and it is pouring. Pouring. I'm still at my sister's house. This morning at like six, we were under a tornado warning, which was really creepy. But because of that, um, my first class was canceled. And my second class is at 12. 30 and she emailed us and said because of the weather she'll still be coming to class but if we live in a place that is that had um a hard time with the weather this morning then we wouldn't be counted as absent if, if we didn't come and although I'm at my sister's house right now I live in a place that's really far away that probably has really bad weather so I'm not gonna go So right now, I'm in my car, I'm leaving my sister's house. 
I'm gonna go to Starbucks because I haven't had coffee this morning. I don't really feel that great still. Like my head just hurts, like a like pollen headache. My throat kind of hurts. I need some coffee, so I'm going to Starbucks. And then I think I might go to Publix and get like a little snack because I'm hungry. And then also my sister found some limited edition lemon ice cream at Publix. And I love lemon ice cream. So I'm gonna go get that because I want to. Well, we'll see how I feel after Starbucks because walking through the rain just then was not super fun at all. So I may or may not be going to Publix. I don't know. But happy Friday. No class. Whoop whoop. So I just ordered at Starbucks and this is what my car looks like now. Lovely. Okay, so I got a venti iced skinny cinnamon dolce latte, you can't see it, with coconut milk. And I'm smiling because one of you requested it, which makes me smile because I got a recommendation by one of you guys. Maybe I'm a dork, but I think that's really cool. And it's really good. So thank you for recommending this drink. I love it. It's so good. Yay! Okay, so I went into Publix because it stopped raining finally. And I got the lemon ice cream and I just wanted to show you because it's so good and you need to try it if you want your life to be changed. So this is it. Lemon sugar cookie, limited edition. Oh, it's so good and it's only at Publix. You've gotta try it and it's like $3.29 for this. So good. So I think I'm gonna end this probably really long video right here because it's Friday and it's the end of the week and I'm going home. And once I get home, I'm probably gonna do some nothing. So anyways, I hope you have a good weekend and I hope that you enjoyed this video and I will see you sometime soon. Thanks for watching. I always feel like that is so awkward. I need to get better at that.